Hand clap to the Massey guys, we are definitely back uh, Really? Hand clap to the Massey guys, we are definitely back again for another one on this channel One only Mr. Lick's react channel guys I'm gonna be doing two videos today guys So with that said, we're gonna be dropping the first one right there Welcome back to the Mr. Lick's family for tuning in to yet another reaction video And of course, the newcomers are there There have been a lot of you guys in the recent videos Big up yourself one time for tuning into this year reaction video guys I have, a, I have a, an app you guys can definitely download it as well not just subscribe but of course subscribe to this year channel click the post notification bell by clicking the bell and then clicking all when you subscribe right there don't forget to do that and of course download the app that'll be the first comment in the comment box below as well now guys we're gonna be talking about the situation that seemingly seems to be happening but before I enter that but, but, but before you get there but before you get into that guys <laughs> what the joke is this um man i've been doing so much videos man it's getting kind of uh, anyways but we're back again guys and of course there was an incident that took place a landslide i believe it is or some rocks falling brothers and sisters some rocks falling in the tower region and this is it right there so let me make this thing bigger for you guys so you guys i don't know why people keep filming you know Vertically, but um, yeah. So there seem to have been some rocks that fell from the sky. Well, not from the sky, but from the southern mountains. Every time I pass in there, brothers and sisters, and if you guys notice or remember when I was, do, I was doing the um the hike video, and then we passed along the, the the mountain sides, I was like, aren't they gonna be doing something about this very same situation or this very same area right there? And of course, we see more rocks are falling in a number of places. Are we going to be doing something or are we waiting as usual for something to happen before we decide Hey, let us take out the rocks on top of the mountains brothers and sisters That is not always a good thing to do things after things have happened We should be in the preventative notion Just like the whole Rona situation, we should have been in the preventative notion Not in the trying to solve notion right there But of course, you know <sighs> Well, hopefully not, nobody got hurt, I didn't see any vehicles or anything like that Nobody, hopefully um, if there were people passing, they heard the noise and started, you know, running like crazy, man. The rocks are falling. Or the sky is falling. One of them brothers and sisters. But be careful right there on this year yeah. road. The, ta the Taro region. The Taro region right there. Anyways, guys, moving along in this regard. Apparently, there is some sort of protest taking place, brothers and sisters. And, of course, that protest is that with the truckers right there. But before I get to that video, guys, I must be going to shout out something. Because it seems like they're complaining about... The Gadakan indiv individual who is apparently from overseas. So where did we come from, brothers and sisters, to 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 stoop so low in our pride as Dominican people, independence, to be reliant on foreigners to give us jobs in our own country? Anyways, they are out there protesting because they don't get no money. Camping time. Hmm. Money. Ties with clothes. Hmm. We need our money. So, you know, we cooking our food and we drinking rum today, dear. On Galakan account. Wait a while, but he says something rather interesting. And we drinking rum today, dear. We need our money. So, you know, we cooking our food. So, if you need money, you then spending money to cook food because you have to pay for the, the stuff that you're about to cook. And then you're going to drink rum. I know rum doesn't come from tree. <laughs> Unless there's some rum tree that flowing with rum, but instead you have to go and buy the rum for you to drink. And you say on Garakan's account, so maybe on his time, which means you're gonna be getting less money because you not have you have not been doing that work. But on the basis of that whole thing, alright, dear brothers and sisters, I mean, you haven't been getting paid at all. And they say banks are, are calling for, for, for monies right now. Dominican truckers, Dominican trucks, truck drivers, Dominican trucks drivers. Dominica truck drivers have not gotten paid since January and the truck drivers blocked the road at Tarish Pit. Breaking news. Banks are making threats to the trucks, to the truck drivers for bank payments. More pregnant issues while Dominican searches for Kernisha ATN right there. So apparently uh, the banks have been calling say, hey yo, where my money boy? Where my money boy? Well, the truckers are asking Garakan, where my money boy? And God, I can't say no. But apparently since January, according to this post right there, um, the, the truckers have not gotten paid. January, it's six months after. You ain't getting paid and you're doing work and stuff. I understand why you have taken a standstill on God, I can't account. But how far do we have to reach, brothers and sisters? How far do we reach? 
for us to understand what, that we are being taken advantage of in our own country. Foreigners have to come in to give man job. Just like Ross had to come in, but no, no, no. Scratch that. Ross was actually Dominica's own. Because the individual who built Ross fell in love with Dominica. And as a result of falling in love with Dominica, wanted to give other students a chance for them to come and see other people in the United States. A chance for them to come and see the beautiful island, the sunset and the rivers and the trees and all, all these kind of things there, which um, Ross students were definitely participating in. I know. I took a number of them out, brothers and sisters. We went all kind of places, cruise, Trafalgar, Emerald Pool, just name it. Somebody wanted to go ball in lake. They go ball in lake. I say I will take a helicopter. But unfortunately, <laughs> no, I want to go ball in lake. <laughs> but there's another story because I've never been to ball in lake. But anyways, with all that stated right there, guys. So Ross was Dominica's own. But we are foreigners from, from thing who established their business outside. Who then coming into Dominica. And the government is the one giving them these jobs. And then they say it's some, um, um, what do you call that again? Um auction some auction who has the lowest and whatnot but if you have an established business and people in dominica don't get much jobs then obviously the people outside outside gonna be winning so even if you say it's auction for for or bidding bidding for 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 jobs and those kind of things there you give it to the lowest set of people dominicans will always end up losing but then again the dominicans themselves under the same companies are not getting paid and the bankers based up the information i got in there stating that they are they, they need their money boy and some of the individuals who took trucks most likely took it from, from a, a mortgage or something for them to be able to get their trucks and stuff, doing the work, and they're not getting paid. But they should be getting paid, man. But on the other hand of this, I don't know why you why you getting all this food there and then coming and cook and say you want more. So there's another story right there. Smoke, me take it, me. <laughs> Smoke. Well, maybe. Well, then again, maybe they 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 they, they go and you know, you know, take some some animals and you know, smoke it up and thing. <laughs> so, so one pocket pot is cooking apparently. They're just chilling, um, waiting for them to get paid. I don't know if they're gonna get paid. They might come and just say, hey, fellas, we'll get, make all you get paid next next week. And then next week, come and all you get paid. Six months, all you'll get my money again. <laughs> six months, you wouldn't get paid. If that is the case, since January, six months, you'll get paid, we? In your own country, <laughs> foreigners make you do get paid for six months. <laughs> what? <laughs> that is intense right there. <laughs> Anyways, guys, so I just showed this a while ago. But moving along, right there, of course, according to whole search and whatnot, we know that this individual is one of those who were somewhat of a stalwart, so to speak, in trying to find uh, the missing little one, right there, Kernisha. And, of course, this is what you have to see right there on the whole situation. So he's saying that's it for him. I don't know if you guys can hear through the wind, but he's saying that's it for him. So apparently he's giving up or, you know, he's, he's realizing that nothing else is coming from his searching. And trust me, I passed him a couple times up there, well, in um, in um, Warner area, and the Bells area as well. And of course, he had a squad with him. But anyways, he said he tried his best, baby. I guess he's calling her baby. He said he's hoping a real determined team um, determined to find you. So I'm guessing he's talking about the authorities. Yeah, it's a confusing situation, man. I mean, some people go up there, like I said before in previous videos, some people just go up there for them to see if they can get a free meal. They come and dress nice. Hey, look me. I dare I show my face. Not true. Free meal, brothers and sisters. Some come in their high heels. Well, I don't see nobody with high heels. But you understand the sentiment? Right there. Some man come in to look nice. And they bling chain. I saw a few people with chain. You go in any bush with gold chain? Whoop, whoop, whoop. But, um, so some people came. And then the police as well. Because some of the police, I have no idea what they were doing. 
they pull up there with 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 with, with um m1 stuff on them i mean this is one of the reasons why i was asking if they don't have any tasers around because i think i don't know maybe they see him running in the bush and they have to pew pew put some pellets and whatnot hopefully take out his foot you know so you wouldn't run they go and get him and what have you i don't know if that is the case right there but some of them will just pull up there and just dr looking you know looking i can't say conspic conspicuous because they were very obvious anyways let's continue I guess the police tell me he can't do certain things and he checking he, he can do it. So that's one of the things that we notice. Um, we notice that a lot of people were doing the searches. The groups that were doing the searches were pretty much by themselves. They didn't have any police officer with them. I remember when he was talking and he was actually mentioning that he needs a police officer with them. And he actually had three of them um, on the second day. But apparently he's stating this now on Sunday, which was yesterday, stating that they drop in them certain areas. The police them dropping them certain areas and they're leaving them and go. Shouldn't the police officers be with them? I think, I think that would be the case, especially understanding that a lot of individuals were planning to do this guy harm. Harm to the point where he could be endangered his life as well as the little one that we are also searching for. Because if you're endangered at that, if you're endangered his life and he's the one who put this little, little one somewhere, if you take his life, then most likely they wouldn't be able to find the little one. But talking about that, guys, they had an interview on Q95 with the, the, the parents. I'm going to be doing that video next, so make sure you guys check it out after. I dropped this video probably like probably 5, 5.30 around that time there. So make sure you subscribe subscribe to the channel so you can get that vibrations and my thoughts as well as well as your thoughts, leaving your thoughts in this regard on the things that she was saying, or the, the mother and the father of, of the madman, so to speak. We call him madman, but we don't think he's mad. He's a very smart individual. He invading the 5 all like crazy, man. People in military attire, you have a madman, you say, lunatic, having all you, have not all, all, you know, us, having us like Maji, we bring drone, we bring all kind of thing. We don't find the man, <laughs> but that is something else, eh? But anyways, guys, we'll make sure you guys tune in for that other part of that video right there. Anyways, let's continue. Want to real police, I'm going to get a bushy boy. Why is he going to get a bushy boy from since that day? Like I tell you, that's one of the things that we saw. Even us, our own group, we had 13 of us. You guys saw us on the Mr. Lick's vlog and video. We went in and there was no police officers with us. It was just us going around and a few people, you know, custom of, 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 of a little training here and there. And that was it. And you know we had a set of sabi. We, we had sabs, you know, brothers and sisters. We even had a Naruto team. <laughs> I call it Naruto, where he kind of spear my partner had. And one of the girls... She had a kind of a, a, a jagged edge, cutlass on both sides. So if you whoop, whoop this way, you're in problem, brothers and sisters. Double job. But anyways, let's continue. Well, that's probably why he's going back. So maybe they tell him that he, he cannot continue going up there. Um, the, I guess they, they started blocking individuals from going up there, which I, which I think it's, 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 it's a, a wise decision in terms of if you want to be using the, the thermal helicopter. Because I've been hearing them say that there's a thermal helicopter around, or some sort of helicopter. Well, local people have been saying that. And up to now, I don't see no helicopter. I don't see no helicopter flying in the sky. So maybe they're trying to get all the individuals out, the civilians out and everything. And then the police is going to coordinate, which they should have been doing from the very beginning. Because a lot of individuals have been known to just be pulled up there. And even though you're trying your best to see if you can volunteer and you willfully want to volunteer, not just for the food, you come and you're trying to volunteer, you are not been getting any word. A number of persons have been saying this very thing as well. Even a white lady who came to Dominica, she relocated to Dominica last year. And she realized in the state of affairs and how, how, how incompetent things are. Especially knowing that we have been doing this before. A number of persons have gone missing. One, only one person I know they got, and it's not even the authorities, the police officers, them that got the, the, the lady. The guy who did this, he, he's from, he, he got his training in Montserrat and moved back to Dominica. That's what one of the individuals in Montserrat told me. He got his training in Montserrat and figured out certain things that he needed to do. 
And it was not the Dominican authorities that found the lady. It was him who found the lady utilizing the skill set. So apparently Dominica seems to be lacking when it comes down to the skill set. And you guys will understand what I'm saying in the next video. Make, make sure you guys tune into that right there. So because he's going to go up and continue, continue doing the searching, he's then deciding to go back home. Yeah. So, um, I guess Kenny G and I guess the rest of the squad will, will not be able to go in. Um, I think they, they have decided to call it off. Yep, based on this thing I'm seeing right there. Civilians back off. I run things and will take care of the search and rescue. So apparently somebody made a, a meme right there on what I think the Prime Minister was saying. I think it was like a day or two days ago he was saying all hands on deck. Well now he's saying okay time for you to go home and thing. Anyways guys moving along right there. So apparently we got this message from apparently Franklin Bellot. Frankie Bellot. I think that's crazy T right there. Um, some individuals have been sending this to me saying stay tuned. We might have some good news investigating steel. I heard a video of an individual who was talking about um he was a farmer i think i have that video you know i think i have that audio guys let me get that audio for you guys right there okay guys we're back so i found the audio and this is the audio right there guys of this uh this is what uh, somebody stated take a listen okay i don't know how true it is but look we just hear a story um a man from our village three like i wouldn't call him a power no but that is like a real garden manager he say when he was um in his spot that is Belfi. Belfi is the little um, place before you reach Castle Bruce, before you reach church. In his spot there, he see a little girl in the bush, like in a cave, like. And he tell her, she tell him, go and call police, the man go for food, whatever. So he go, he let the police know, and now police go on the scene. We don't hear no news yet, we don't know how to treat people. So that is what uh, an individual is stating based on the report that she got. Uh, some farmer individual apparently went up there, you know, went for some food and then saw some girl and she, the girl indicated go for the popo, you know, the 5 -0 and what have you and then thing. But then again, uh, there's another audio, this one right there. I want you guys to listen to this. Take a listen to this. Anyways. So apparently based on that audio, the girl is by herself. And then in this one, apparently this one took place last night, I think it was. Uh, they're saying that he's in the village. The man in the village, eh? Do open all your door and sell nothing for nobody for the rest of the night. Hmm. Man scared. The man in the village is not to say not do nothing at all. Serious business. The man, they see the man up by on the mango tree where Shana used to stay there. Who is they? Who, who is they that say that? Who is they? By the mango tree right there. They see somebody see the man there tonight there a while ago. I was a uh, half an hour ago. So nobody get a report. People so scared of the man, they are afraid to confront the man. Well, they, they feel the man will kidnap them, kidnap them or something. I mean, we we so far apart the 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 Warner area or Bell's area, wherever it is, so far apart that they 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 afraid to. Hey, look in there, what that whoop whoop. But again, if he shot, he might just run inside the bush and then. But at least you know exactly the area he is, or how fast is is the the authorities able to respond. I think that's probably why some of them are actually there. So if they hear some information, hey guys, we can come there, boom, bang, they, they run from the command center and go over there instead of them being the bush, have to run up and then go. Maybe that's, that, that makes sense right there. But I mean, most of them, I, do, I don't see why, why they just, some of them just pull up. I mean, you can have a few handful individuals. They don't have to have like 20 people they, they just stand up. I mean, come on. Is one man me? What, what, is, is Superman not there or something? But anyways, guys, this individual has something. So I guess that's what the, what that's what um, this individual is saying. If this post is actually true, you guys will let me know. Of course, this is a reaction where I just give my reactions on different things that I see. So you guys will let me know if that is the case right there. Anyways, guys, this is an individual who has a number of things to say, and this is him. I don't know who he is, but yeah. Well, let me make this bigger. I don't know why people like to film. He's not on Instagram, all you be. All you filming like that way, no. It have a horizontal film, you know, you forget, man. Anyways, let me continue. I say I'm not going and say nothing, you know. I said I don't go and say nothing, and I've been quiet on the situation. But you see that caca video? 
like which kind of video are you talking about is the video of the of the guys circulating circling the thing and then pointing who pp the dog cannot cannot smell is that the, that one you're talking about it don't show you guys caca they're working hatically so that's somebody else or maybe that's somebody's nick nickname <laughs> we just give ourselves some strange nicknames you boy caca really <laughs> you check me and he started the movement and I myself was there from the get go, and I don't big up because for the little girl I do in it because I have a little girl, and if it was me, I won't help. I you won't want help, help to find okay. and make that child sleep on a bed again. So it's not for big up. Yep. Do do the heart of Dominicans, man. The, 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 the local people, especially, you can tell that a lot of them, not all of them, you know, but a lot of them, majority of them, actually, you know, want to help and so forth. Anything big up. But what that happened in there, I will just simply tell you in a, in, in, in in a, a nutshell. Way. Colloquial language. Okay, never mind. Why that is happening? Peter paying for Paul. Hmm. Right? Peter paying for Paul. That's what happened in there. No civilians on board because Peter paying for Paul. One word that can describe the reasoning behind the police the one in civilian is movie money. Avenge Voas. <laughs> that is what that have that civilian, no civilian. I don't think it's that. It could be that could be a part of it, but I don't think that it's in entirety that that's what it is. I think they're trying to clear the area so they can probably utilize the helicopter they see they have. That that's my thoughts. I do see the helicopter. Some of all you say, well, you see it. So hey, <laughs> it is what it is. But let's continue. No civilians, because people too envisage. People <laughs> come there for the payout. Oh, you mad? <laughs> Imagine I remember they was talking about the pillow back in the day. We or Melissa them giving people pillow. Melissa and Junil are giving people pillow, and then they come in and make noise about people wanting pillow. <laughs> Anyways, let me continue. The pillow they come for. Yep. I some, with some of them come for pillow for real. These people that stand up on the attending dandy clothes. Hmm. They cannot give you a logistic. They cannot give you an idea. They cannot give you no form of direction. As to what we're going to do, people just loitering and eating hell out. <laughs> but then again, um, um, I think I think I can have an argument for that though. Because since a lot number of persons were there, and of course you guys saw the video when a number of individuals were talking, asking for direction, and the police officers themselves didn't know what directions to give, the communication wasn't the best at all. Um, there were a number of persons who were saying that, even the white lady, like I, I mentioned a while ago, and of course, if there are no directions and you're trying to figure out what to do, is either you just go willy nilly like what we did. We just went willy nilly saying, okay, let's go Sultan, let's go Bells, let's go Warner, let's see what we can find. Just going in any bush and searching and seeing what we find. If we find something interesting, we go closer and that was it. But I guess the individuals who were actually there in, by the command center area, they were not given proper instructions. So they were just waiting uh, for them to be placed in groups. Uh, you know, and as they were waiting, you know, people did had food there. Why not? I mean, if I was waiting, I would be partaking too. Communion have to make ding dang, brothers and sisters. Ha, the Lord's Supper. Forget communion. Communion too small. The Lord's Supper will take make ding dang right there. But I guess individuals are just waiting to see um what is the direction that they're gonna be pointing individuals. But a number of persons were complaining, stating that they, they, they had no idea what was going on. So that could be a factor as well. I know there are some people who came and dressed up nice for them to come and dine, brothers and sisters. They don't lunch or they, they check in. Boy, things are hard. I have to pay for dumb leg and the wasco and all this kind of something there. So I might as well go up and get a free meal and then go work afterwards, brothers and sisters. There were individuals. If you saw the vlog, brothers and sisters, when we were going back to the command center, you could see some individuals dressed nice. They dress nice, brothers and sisters, walking slowly and they're going, you know, <laughs> about the whatever business that is. So, there, you can look at it from two sides. Some people actually helped. Some people actually came to help. By help, I mean they went up by themselves and do their own thing, like us. Some people came to help, uh, waiting for instructions, which of course was not communicated properly. And some people came to help themselves <laughs> with some free meals right there. So anyways, let's continue. Goat water, hmm? soup with dumplings, hmm. tricks, pushing <laughs> buster in their bag. Oui. Their bag has seven busts, but they rest anything they ride. <laughs> and they're going back for more. <laughs> they come and sell buster in their shop, man. Some store people was there, man. What the joke is that? They come and sell buster, boy. 
Boy, I tell you. Taking water, taking snacks. <laughs> that is for their child for tomorrow. It has people that have been doing boy. that. <laughs> boy, people know he's in a boy. Boy, all you know he's in a boy. Checking boy school tomorrow, boy. Let me gather some snacks for my child. Things are hard. We paint them leg and whatnot. Guys, look, my camera just go off there. <laughs> I have to change the battery right there. But some people checking, yeah. Free stuff. We come and get. Things are hard. Scary making things hard for Dominica. Might as well come and get some free meals, man. Anyways, let's continue. Shooting up the area. The police cannot think of what to do next because why they have so much civilians. And they have to protect the food. <laughs> boy, look trouble in that place, there. That have moving money Boy. on their hands and on their accounts. That is why. Good but I'm, I'm thinking to myself. I'm thinking about. I'm just thinking about myself based on this situation. Nobody telling us nothing. Nobody communicating properly. Hey, I come and help. Uh, those who actually come and help are waiting for information. Might as well just take some free drinks. Eh? Well, you have me there waiting, wasting my time. What? No, boy. Let me get some free meals for wasting my time. Let me get some from some juice. Hey, my children have to get. Let me go and get some, man. Or they call their children and say, come up and get a thing, man. They take two and everybody go down with two and you have four children at your house. So ten drinks, including yourself. Ten drinks, man. Come down in the place sometimes. Or you take three and four saying I don't get. <laughs> I did that. I did that on New Year's Eve, but people know I take stuff. Anyways, let's continue. Searching rescue people have to be feeling away and feeling disrespected. Hmm. When they come there. I went up there yesterday I, and you know me and my petrol. Hmm. You already know me and my petrol shatter. <laughs> I, I remember. Oh, he that is the one that was walking on the road. Okay. He's like, what? My petrol thing? Your yeah, petrol finished for the month, so you walk in. I remember. Okay, no, I remember who that is. Tell them and tell me, Jamais, nothing doing. You can go inside. I say, what, father? Hmm. But I come up to one of one of a serious healing, Shatter. True. Shatter, one of a serious healing, you know. That drinking and there's a two gallons of gas in you know, that healing. You know. Well, I don't know about that, but okay, okay. I feel away for my petrol and for my time. Mm -hmm. And for the time that I've invested in that already. But I sit down and I think and I say, my boy, it is right. The police need to think. The police need to screen who they have in on the teams. Yep. But their own team they just have it. Because in the police team, I, I don't know, they just be amongst themselves and they're making the civil, civilians go by themselves, so... Because it's a lot Not all of them, eh? I remember in the starting, just like the Kenny G video, I saw, I saw three police officers with him, or people in blue. They weren't dressed in military, but they were dressed in blue. I guess they're ready for people to see them in blue. <laughs> a lot of loitering happening up there, and they are vanish. Long little it is jail go short there, who so they come in there it is jail go short. Stop the nonsense. But Kaka, you know, I don't feel no way because I myself, I don't feel no way I study after a while because I think of it. It's a vieux, it's a vieux. You check, they come there for the jail go short and the busters, the leg buster. It's all that now, but I wonder if it's a potato salad boy. You should have some potato salad there, man. Some potato salad, some macaroni and cheese, you know, some figure pie, man. Yes, sir. Some Akara. And the quenchy. Long name, they never eat a snapple. They say, what juice is that? <laughs> oh, really? Well, then again, it's possible. This is Dominica. They don't know what is a snapple. <laughs> they come in there, what juice is that? Now, nah, looking nice. They never see a snapple. That cannot be real. I don't believe in that. No, sir. In their life. No, sir. They don't come and look for. That's a boy. But anyways, you're not ready. We're not ready for civilians again. And serious civilians on board there. Eh? Yeah. Screen them and it's teams you going by. We're not ready, idea. But do all your thing. The police officers do right. Lock down the place, man. They too yep. moving money and a vieh. Fool us. Hey now you're asking for ketchup, you have your own. <laughs> you want ketchup. Eat the food and one hunt. <laughs> hey. Shit. But it's not supposed to go and hunt first and then and eat the food. They should they should have screened people and say, Oh, you come you come with an hunt, you come with one thing? Okay, you can get some food. You don't come out and hunt? No. Like the Bible say, a man that should work hard should not eat, brothers and sisters. He hungry, but he don't work, he shouldn't eat. Man, you don't come in up there hungry stomach. How is that? How are you doing that there? Anyways, guys, let me know your thoughts in this regard. Leave your thoughts in the comment box below. These are just my thoughts. What about right there? Do you think that they should have shut down the spot? They, they, they shouldn't have shut down the spot. Uh, do you think that the, the, the locals should have continued 
What are your thoughts guys? Leave your thoughts in the comment box below. Give this video a thumbs up guys. Don't forget I'll be doing a second video today. So keep it on lock. Probably two hours from this video. Right there. You will definitely get to see that video. One hour and a half or something like that. You will get to see that other video when it drops. I'll be, you know, um, reacting to the parents. Uh, not all of it, but the parents uh, of the madman. Or the zombie possessed madman. Right there. Anyways guys, keep it locked. Don't forget to download the app, Mr. Lix Tube app on the Play Store. Of course, that'll be in the first comment in the comment box below. Hopefully, I also put the, 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 the other vlog for you guys to see the latest vlog when we're out, out there and whatnot, you know, searching and finding different clues and what have you. And we don't, don't even know if there are clues or not, but hey, we found them. And of course, if the police officers are there, they definitely get to see this. Hopefully, um, this is, is, is definitely some good news right there. Hopefully, this is the actual truth in this regard. Of course, stay tuned. We might have some good news. Uh, we heard the audio saying, somebody saying that some guy saw the girl. And um, so a girl, I shouldn't say the girl, but a girl, and she was asking for, for, for help. And then we heard that this guy is moving along in the nighttime. Apparently, he's stationed in the day and moving up and down in the nighttime. And of course, um, um, you know, some individuals stated that they saw him right there. I don't know what they saw. Maybe this zombie they see. But hey, we haven't gotten any word as a result of this. Hopefully, we'll get some more word. I think this audio came out yesterday. Yes, yesterday I got this audio about them finding police go on the scene. Yeah, police go on the scene. So hopefully they find something or you know find a trail or something like that. And then of course that little girl is found. Um uh, will anyways guys, I will react to the the parents' video next. So keep it up, give this video a thumbs up. I would appreciate that. That will cause the algorithm of YouTube to push your videos further and further. So give this video a thumbs up right now if you reach the end of this year video and I'll see you guys in the next reaction video. Boom bang.